I am not customer support. I cannot help you. I, I don't know what server you want to connect to. I have no clue what you're talking about. I mean, I'll be honest. There's no v shape server. I don't know what you want. Bird! Alright, how about, how about we sell some? Do something, advertise something as valuable. Really? Am I like black market dealer hands? Am I like the one you go to if you want like the video shit? Is that my role? Sorry, and, um, The roles we have. Okay, what's the last part? What is the last part? <laughs> like market dealer. Yo, 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 do you want the nice new shades? Yo, I got new shades. Come on. Let's do it. New three shades. Zero shadows. Zero clear colors. Proceed the blend out in base with color. Easily. Easily. The comp, you want the hexagon. On. I mean, if you want half the comp, yeah, that will cost you a bit more. You know, it's, it's an honest hustle, you know? I think you charge this even more the less. Alright, I'm just late.
particular reason why you're not a fucking squad. I talk shit 24 7, y'all. I don't think I'm. I'm not the ideal focus, but. I'm not a face because I don't have a So the grand value that I have is really nice. Also, I sell these shades on the side. of all time. An honest side hustle. Oh, the shades, the shaders. I'm making him a little bit Why? Bro, I just turned into Yoda. What the hell? Um. What I buy? No, we don't have to buy it. All we got. Take us now. Yeah, your game will be. Side of the street. Yo! Well, well, well. That is. Bro. <laughs> Yo, that park is like one year old. What? Yo? going next what the hell that's crazy bro going next is cancelled bro i never lose those Boy. sorry man oh he's montacking me bro what Hey everyone, John here from Run the Stargaze, and I've just been sent the new C-Star Smart Telescope from ZWO. Now, Kui the Lazy Geek has several videos on this telescope, and he covers pretty much everything you need to know. But there's one thing that I have that the Lazy Geek does oh, not, and too. that's dark skies. So let's get in the car, go to Stargaze Nova Scotia, and see how this telescope performs. Before I show you the scenes from our dark sky location in Stargaze Nova Scotia, I did get a chance to test the telescope here in the city. I tried to use it in a way that most people who buy this telescope are Fuck. using it. And we can tell exactly how other people are using this telescope because of the community you feature. You simply the select this option here, and there's a feed of images posted by other Seastar owners. 
And as you're gathering images, you can share your images with the community too. See, now, if oh, you okay. scroll through this list, like you'll notice hoodie. that most of the Over images posted here so only like have a, a few minutes of exposure time, my, okay, as no, opposed no, to the several hours okay, a serious astrophotographer no, might no, gather. No Some are upwards of an hour, but that seems to be the exception rather than the rule. In other words, cozy, people are using this telescope just as they would a oh telescope gosh. designed for visual observations. They're only staying on a single enough. target for a short period of time before moving on. That said, let me show you some images that I took from here in the city. You'll notice that some of these images have a gradient, which is either caused by the nearby light or by light pollution, since it's brighter in this part of the sky, which is closer to downtown. Okay, here are my images from the city. Here's a 31 minute exposure of the like horse head nebula. Here's a 35 minute exposure of the elephant trunk. Here's a 47 minute exposure of galaxy M33. Here's a 31 minute exposure of the Andromeda galaxy and its satellite galaxy M110. Here's just a four minute exposure on the crescent nebula. I wonder if the whole heart is the Here's double star Albirio. Here's the dumbbell nebula M27 like after just two hunt. minutes. And here's a touch. one minute exposure of Globular Cluster M13. You can also take amazing videos of the moon, just Very like at this hard. live image. You can zoom in and out. Mm. You can take a photo, yeah, probably. a video, what do you mean or even a time lapse. Photo, though, you like can also take images of the planets too, but they're pretty small in this telescope. Here's Jupiter from a couple of evenings ago. Now there are two nebula we're going to shoot from here in the city the as well as from our Dark like Sky barely, site, barely Stargaze Nova like Scotia. The, the first is the Pac-Man Nebula, here's a 10 minute exposure from the city, and the second, name? the famous Orion Nebula here impossible. at 13 impossible. minutes of exposure. Yeah, completely impossible. Okay, now on to our Dark Sky test Scandalous. site. All right, we're here at Stargaze Nova Scotia. Oh, the skies are pitch black, and we're about to open the oh, ZWO Sea Star Telescope <laughs> and put it Bro, to the test. Bro, you know how long I thought about a name for this? It's like we made this, like multi-meter spreadsheet. We're like, you no see how way, small this, this tripod insane. is. I love the concept. Really tiny. We extend it no, all the way. Na naming things tiny. like hard as fuck. I made like a video for Naughty Bear, but I, I don't know what to name it. I still know. Let's put it up here on the fries. It's fully ready, but I don't know. Let's hold the on. Oh, All right, we're gonna hit connect. We're gonna search for the telescope. Oh, can't just. That's cool that it talks. Are oh, you jumping or something? You can't just call it. All right, it start exploring. From the city a couple nights ago, I checked out the Pac-Man Nebula. So I think we'll go back to that now that we're in like dark some, skies. Something like funny. It has to and see how cool. they compare. Okay. Okay. It's kind of like a combination. Okay, it's, so like, got it's, it's a really a level uh, diagram here. Ah! Because at home I just set this up on the deck. No one need to that. think about it. Finish your guess. Okay, I think that's good enough. Let's go to our first target what, here. What do I have as a tunnel? Let me go to the map. What is the last thing I have left? All right, we're above the horizon on the map. So how about the naughty stuff? Let's go over to the path down the other one. Maybe? So we're going to pass it over here. Okay. Yeah. What the hell? The title so right now that I have. There it is. When naughty bar goes out of college. That's crazy. Right, go to. Kind of this. We can see on the screen like that it says identify. Right. And so that means it's taking the picture of the sky to know where it is. Now it says going to the object, so we can see the telescope is moving yeah, again. Like something yeah, so witchy? Like Naughty Bear and Deep. How do you do that? Alright. Finish focusing, you can see the stars are quite a bit sharper. Alright, like so the, uh, the button here to start taking image. Of course, this is a nebula, I'm not going to put that filter on, even though the sky goes out. I want to see the all things equal to what we did last night. I'm going to hire someone that does it, just titles. That would be insane. I'm going to take a minute to, I assume, take some titles. Because then I don't have to think. Choices are made. Hopefully, my filming is not... I never want the choice. I just want to do things. Got a choice. Is that a choice? Wait, how many of them? Open the way. Is it going to be a choice? Okay, we're going to pay attention. Ten seconds, and then it's going to apply what's called calibration. So 
it is our first flame, you can already see uh, it's going to be lost in this game. Alright, so we've been focusing on the Pac Man Nebula for about half an hour, and we've gathered 11 minutes of time. Maybe when we shouldn't waste it. So I'm guessing that because it's not perfectly level, I'm losing a few shots due to star trails. So we're not as time efficient as we were from the city where the telescope was sitting on Pickens. Is this something like that? The other thing I noticed that was interesting. See there, we've got another stack fail. Uh, because this is not equatorial, oh, because of the right? phantasm, the position no of the nebula in the image ah, is, is, is different yeah. depending on what time of night we started taking exposure and where in the sky the target is. I'll do it! Ah! Do I do it? And the last one is. Yeah. The Orion Nebula, the most popular star using any alphabet on Oh my god, I need to hire. Who knows the alphabet? 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 Who Oh, it's the AFK, how you call me? I'm not being a CFU. It says it's an AFK. Not quite. So, what you can do here is use the little hand controller and move it around. It's Okay, so tonight we were joined by the Dalhousie Astronomical Society, or DAS, Dalhousie Accounting Society. Okay. All right. Uh, anyway, they were really helpful uh, helping me set up for this video and helping out here at Stargate, Nova Scotia. All right, so the CSTAR has been taking data on the Orion Nebula for about 20 minutes. We have 10 minutes and 20 seconds of data. We'll use the filter for that. It is so cold. We're gonna pack it in. And we've also got some students here from Dalhousie University and they need to go home as well. So I think we're done for the night, but this has been really fun, uh, really easy just to be able to drop the CSTAR uh, here on the ground. Um, at Stargaze Nova Scotia and start taking stack images immediately, so with almost no setup. So I hope you enjoyed this video on ZWA's new Sea Star Smart Telescope. Subscribe to learn the Stargaze so you don't miss the next video. And remember to future. You're not allowed to lot. You're literally breaking the law. Preschool? I think it's very good for me. I will not lie. Let's see the pestle move. 